Hey guys, see a lot of you uh, have joined. Um, we're going to be getting started with the giveaway uh, just in a bit here. I kind of started a bit early. I'll go through the rules and everything um, when that happens. Give it maybe like 10 minutes. Uh, hey Lone, hey Ryan. <laughs> Someone's like, I read a comment, someone, someone said I only talk through donations. No, I don't, but I can see donations because it highlights and it also shows up on my end. Like it actually separates that person's comment. So that's why I catch it more easily. Like the regular chat I see as well, but it's hard for me to actually see it when the chat is scrolling so fast. Even with the 20, um, what is it? The slow mode, 20 seconds or whatever. Um, for those of you just posting your pilot ID in your platform, um, if I could ask you to just hold because that's not how you will be entering. Um, if you do that, it's a guaranteed loss. Um, so today I'm, I'm actually going to be running on my own account. That's why the screen is kind of small. I am on iOS, so I'm going to be running on my main account here. Um, I'll just go through a couple of things first. So I'm getting really close to um, Operations 100. So I'm going to get the, uh, the Phantom really soon. I actually saved. Like I didn't want to play any more games today because I knew I was probably going to hit that 100 level today during the stream. So we're going to get the Phantom. Um, I think if I remember, we are almost at a thousand keys. So we're going to open up a gold chest as well. And then we're going to do, let's see, how many do I have here? Six. I might be able to open seven of these. Just see. Oh no, don't tell me it's going to freeze up on me. For whatever reason, every time, well not every time, sometimes it happens. Hold on. I get that weird spinning wheel when I go to uh, the special event thing. Well, I guess the good news is if Pixonic's watching, they will probably fix that because how are players supposed to get their prizes or buy coins? Just saying. Okay, let's try this again. Let's see if it works now. Six. Yeah, we have 680 here. Uh, do more giveaways. I only do giveaways on Sundays usually, unless it's something really special. So, um, I'm going to actually wait for like 10 minutes after, I think, and then I'll go through the rules and stuff. So if you're posting now, um, you, you probably were not going to win. So just wait. <laughs> Thanks, Des. And uh, congratulations on 150k subs. So yeah, that's one thing I wanted to do was to thank everyone for uh, supporting my channel, my YouTube channel. Because without you guys, I would not be at 150,000. In fact, I'm kind of shocked that I'm even here. <laughs> kind of shocked I even got to a hundred thousand let alone here. You know like when I started my channel, it's kind of weird um, I actually just started putting up. Well, I don't know. Do you guys know the story of how I started YouTube? So this is gonna be the story <clears throat> So what happened was I was playing walking more robots. I had I didn't even know how to do YouTube or anything like that <laughs> I just started playing more robots or walking more robots at the time and I ran into this one clan and I noticed like they weren't taking damage so I wanted to record games to kind of catch them in the act 
and then I needed a place to like post these games so naturally I thought YouTube because at the time I was watching YouTube so I was like okay well why not let's just do it this way so that's kind of how I started YouTube but what I didn't actually realize was that there were actually players out there that were watching my videos and they were commenting I didn't even know how to read the comments and stuff I was just like posting my videos that for like reference until someone joined Clan Vox <laughs> and he asked me He's like, Adrian, do you know that like you get like 50,000 views or something and I think I had 15,000 views and like 70 subscribers. I don't know. It's not, I didn't have that much. So I was like, no. <laughs> and he was commenting under all of my videos, but I wouldn't reply back because I didn't even know to go back. Like I wasn't even thinking about it. So that's kind of how I started. And then more and more players just started asking me for like help and stuff. So that's kind of how I... At the time, Pixonic was not even, like, they weren't even involved until, like, I think, like, after 15,000 subscribers. And I only started using, like, the Battle Rick account, like, much later. It was, like, I think maybe, I don't even know when. Was it maybe closer to 100,000, I think? Most of the time, I was actually using my own account, which is this account. Thanks, Wizard. So that's how I started. <laughs> Sweet how things turn out, right? Okay, so um, so we're gonna go through um, we're gonna go through the rules, I guess, because we have officially started now. Um, so what I'm gonna be giving away, I'm gonna be giving away 100 of these saw weapons. Uh, obviously not maxed out, just the level one where you can get it uh, in the store. But at least you won't have to save up platinum for it. Um, so another thing too, if you've won any giveaways uh, on my channel in the past four weeks or past month unfortunately you cannot participate I know it kind of sucks but at the same time I have to do this because there are viewers out there who have not won anything and I want to give them a chance so hopefully you guys understand uh, there are going to be obviously more giveaways in the future um, it could be maybe the new weapons maybe even the new titans who knows uh, thank you Roger <laughs> you were subscriber number 149 for real did you actually write that down so uh, yeah, so we're going to be giving away 100 of these, there's going to be 100 uh, winners and I'm going to be choosing 50 from the live stream chat and 50 from the comment section once the stream is done. So you can, you can post like 3, 4 times during the stream, um, try not to actually spam and then when the stream is done you can always post in the comment section uh, to increase your chances of winning, okay? And in order to uh, enter Oh shoot, you know what, I just realized I forgot to actually add that scene. I thought I forgot something. Hold on, hold on, hold on guys. <laughs> I've got I've to add something here. Uh, I had to, the reason why I actually forgot this. <laughs> actually wait, no I do have it. Okay, there we go. Why did I think I, hold on. Okay, there we go. In order to enter, you need to do the following. You have to make sure that you subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already, chances are you probably have. But if you haven't, I would greatly appreciate it because every time we climb up in subscribers and I get to do more special giveaways like these, uh, make sure that you click on the bell notification icon if you haven't already and turn on all the channel notifications so that you get notified when we do giveaways like these when we do live streams when I release content stuff like that <laughs> you made that up uh, make sure to give the stream a thumbs up and then a comment related to the stream so maybe you guys can tell me what Titan you are running right now uh, you know if you're gonna use the saw like what kind of setup would you use on your Titan if you were to win the saw something related to that or maybe it might be something that funny that happens during the stream you could mention that include your pilot ID in your platform make sure that you don't spam multiple times um, because actually what happens is YouTube tends to block that out and I don't see your comment so be very careful of that and um, yeah so that's just what you need to do in order to uh, enter okay so I think that I think that covers uh, that part so I'm going to go ahead and we are going to run some games.
Oh, I guess I should show you, for those of you that don't know where to find your pilot ID, I keep on forgetting. If you go to the settings, the top right, so where I have my name, it has my pilot ID. There's a little icon, like if you click on it, this window should pop up and you can just paste it into the chat. Uh, make sure that you do double check as well because um, if you happen to win and you post the wrong pilot ID then you will lose and I can't go chasing after this is something that Pixonic told me not to do so yeah make sure you double check thank you Paige Paige Suk Sukup is that how you pronounce your name I'm not sure anyways we're gonna be running some uh, Beacon Rush today uh, wait I guess I should go through my hangar right Okay, so my Loki, we've got uh, Sinister Rhymes. Um, someone was actually asking me in another Discord chat, asking if they should get their Loki to max MK2. I told them I actually don't even run a Loki at max MK2. Mine's only MK2 level 1, but I do have a last stand heavy armor kit anti control. So you can see what I'm running there. Uh, here are my skills. And then we have the behemoth actually i think someone wanted me to run redeemers on here maybe i'll switch things up i don't know i got avengers those are my modules here are my whoops here are my skills sorry i can't uh, accept invites during the stream because if i do it everyone's gonna start sending like if i accept and it might crash the stream and then i have to call things off and then there's no giveaway which kind of sucks so hopefully, hopefully you understand, but thanks for the invite. Okay, so we have the uh, Aljung next with the uh, Dragon Calamity. Um, my one Calamity is maxed out, my other one, I kind of didn't get to that. I will eventually. <laughs> Those are the modules I have. Um, I do have the Yang Li pilot, so I did max this out. That's what I'm running. Thanks, Lone. Um, I maxed out my Ravana. I think last time you guys saw me, I had it at like MK2 level 5 or 6. It is max now. So we got Storms on here. Oops. That's what I have. Here's my skills. Um, if you guys ask me to run Cryos, I can't run Cryos on here because I don't have any Cryos. <laughs> That's why I have to use Storms. Leech Scourge. Those are my modules. Those are my skills. And then we're going to get to the author. So I guess the two builds that I might run today is the Rupture and the Saw, which is the pure rocket setup. And here are the modules. And the other one would be the Saw and the Retaliator, which I think a lot tend to kind of favor. Okay, so we're going to be, uh, we're going to be running that. And uh, this is where I'm at in terms of my operations. So I have almost reached level 100, which is good because I still have seven days left. Thank goodness. The last one, I just barely made it by. I had like four and a half hours to spare. <laughs> That's how close it was. Um, hold on, let me just check something here. I gotta make sure that I monitor my PCU usage just in case. Sorry, dude. You know. <laughs> you gotta get some beacons here quick. Well, we don't even have a beacon. Oh, this might be bad. Okay, wait. Is there someone going down to the bottom? Yes, we do. Um, I need to. I need to run some beacons. Yep. Does this guy have the pilot? Oh, he does. I'm just trying to put some beacon pressure here on these guys. Get them away from the... Um, my thinking is get them away from the gap area. If I can do that, then I can... It helps to drive the beacon bar down. If I can get another beacon, even better. So if I change this, I'm just going to try to sit on this beacon for as long as possible. Um, because, you know, like our be their beacon bar is going to get drained. So, I still have my last stand. I can use my phase shift after this just to prolong it a bit. So, we'll do that. Let's 
It's to be really annoying. It's taking three guys. I can't leave this beacon yet. Which is good because now my team can attack the other beacons and get that one. Uh -oh, he's trying to line up his weapons. Ah, ah. <laughs> I'm going to use R. Oh, there we go. Finally. Okay. <laughs> this guy. This guy's from iOS. I think. Oh. But if he flies off this uh, beacon here, we're going to get it. Whoa, wait. What? We've only got one beacon. What happened to my team? We had so many beacons. Oh, dude. Okay, at least we got this one. I think my team gave up all the beacons. You're gonna see my leech go really fast if they get that third one. Okay, I better go to this area here because they're gonna get this one too. Let's get this guy down to his last end. Yes! Uh oh. Whoa, what the heck is this guy running? He's running. Oh shoot. <laughs> He's running a really weird combo. Mm, you know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna drop in over here. Actually, wait. Oh, I can't use my Titan. Oh! No, 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 he's gonna death fart me. Um, I think he did hit me there, but I'm gonna stay here just in case. I don't want to give up this beacon, man. I can't give this up. Oh, shoot, what is my team doing? No, we're losing all our beacons. Guys, 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 what the heck? Jeez, four... Okay, I need an escape plan here. We need to get another beacon fast. Wait, why do I only have three players on my team? Oh, shoot. <laughs> Come on, man. Gotta get him to trigger that quick. Maybe push this side. Dude, I swear we're gonna lose now. We had such a huge lead. He's gonna... Oh, shoot. Okay. I must try to take this guy out. If I can, if I can, if I can. Mm. Oh jeez, I think I'm gonna lose this now. My team can't even get the, the gap. We can't even... We only have one beacon. What the heck? Come on, I need it. I need to get here quick. Ah, shoot. Oh, come on. <laughs> All three, you serious? I'm trying to take out as many of these guys as possible. Maybe my teammates... I mean, there's, there's five of us, surely. What the heck are they doing, man? I don't think I'm going to win this. I pinned this guy against a wall. I'm going to fart on him. That's close range farting right there. Oh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to win this one now. There's no ways. There's no ways. Oh, jeez. Not even a maxed hanger could save me in this situation. <laughs> beacon running. I try to get another beacon. I don't know what my team was doing. We had so many players. You would think they would have gone to another beacon or something. I mean, I was trying to push. Ugh. It's a problem when you play ran with randoms.
You know what the crazy thing is? The other team actually had five players. I should have just kept on pushing more beacons. Oh, we're so close to that 100, uh, level 100. Let's just get this. The other team played well. That's what you need to do in order to win. If you want to beat players that are stronger than you in terms of equipment, go for beacons. That is proof. Everyone keeps telling me you need maxed everything to win. That's actually, uh, that's not true. The vengeance since it's accurate. Okay. Um, I think just start with my leecher first. Let's see if the other team will do that too. <laughs> Where is my team? Oh jeez, I might lose here again. Sometimes I get a good idea based on where my teammates are at the start of the game. This is going to be a tough game as well, I think. Yes, my last stand was saved a bit. Ah, I got triggered. Maybe I can bust this guy's shield, maybe? Nope. See how we only have one beacon? Okay, I need to, I need to see if I can try to turn things around here. We need to get beacons fast here because I'm not sure what my team's doing. Not going for beacons again. That's how you lose games, man. Okay, I'm gonna go for this beacon here. Some beacon pressure on the other team. Okay, I'm gonna stay away from the walls here because this guy, he's gonna fire at the wall. Let's try to get this beacon now since they all followed me there. Maybe I can get this beacon. Ah, oh, shoot! Come on, guys, help me out here. We could have got this beacon. Let's take that guy out. Man, they got our home beacon. Oh. Oh, of course. You know why? Because there's a guy back there firing hydras. He gave up. <laughs> he gave up our home beacon. Let's see if we can get this beacon back. Maybe I can steal this beacon? I have to sacrifice this uh, Loki, I think. I need to get more firepower now. We need to... Oh, jeez. No, 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 no. Ah, come on, guys. What the heck? Dude, every time we get a beacon, we lose like three. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna put some pressure on this side here because we've only got one beacon now. There's no ways we're gonna win like this. If I can actually get this beacon and maybe drop in with my Arthur, I could take out this Ao Ming as well. Not that guy though, he's got a death fart! No! Oh, we gotta get out of here. 
I'm just trying to do as much damage here to this uh, this Ao Ming so he doesn't become a problem to my teammates. There we go, we took him out. I won't be able to take this guy out though. Ah, shoot. <laughs> ah! Okay, time to drop in my Titan. Let's move. Thanks, Vomit! This guy's gonna try to suppress me here. Wait. Trying to get closer to the side. <laughs> yes! Going for this guy next. Default! Trying to take out this uh, guy here. Take out their titans. Just think that the saw is gonna fire quicker than this. And they buff it. There we go. This guy's gonna. He's gonna fly it. Oh, I got this guy with splash. This guy's flying too close. Ah, see what happens. No fly zone. <laughs> oh shoot. Ah, that guy's just gonna be, he's gonna be hiding and then firing. Yeah, I see what you're gonna do. You know what? I'm just gonna go straight for that beacon. Let's hit some of these guys. Shield up here. That guy just gave me his own beacon. Thank you. Let's go for this guy. I'll deal with that guy later on. Actually, I don't need to. The game's gonna be over. Just focus on this player. There we go. Did a little bit better this time around. Oh, someone was asking me to look at player profiles. So you're gonna notice um, on the screen, some players don't have like keys. The ones that don't have keys, they are probably on Android or Amazon. So they're on a different platform. That's kind of how it works. If you see they have keys. So for example, uh, this guy here. See, I can't, I can't see his uh, profile or this one over here. They're on different platforms. This guy here, I can take a look at. He's on iOS. Hey boss lady. Yes. Look what we got guys. We got level 100. Nice. Okay, so now. Oh wait. I actually get a Hades from this too? What? This is not a special one, is it? I could have gone to collect or... Uh oh, it's sp not spinning right. Oh, it's just a regular Hades. Okay, so we got to level 100 during the stream, which is nice. 
Uh oh, it's taking a while. Better deliver it. Got the Stella Phantom. Yes. Let's see if we can find him. Or does it take a while? Last time I checked, I couldn't find. Or did it put it in the second one? Hold on. Sometimes I have to reset the game and then it will show. There we go. Stellar Phantom. I'm not sure if I'm going to level it up. I was thinking to at one point, but then I thought, you know what? Loki's better right now than Phantom, I think. Okay, so we're going to do... Do this. Um, do we have... Oh, 991. Okay, and here we got 700. Okay, so we can do this. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put up on the screen again. For those of you who have just dropped by and you want to win a saw, which is... Uh, hold on, let me just go to that. So this weapon over here, I'm going to be giving away a hundred of these. Um, just before I get into the details of how you enter. If you've won on my channel in the past four weeks or month, you cannot enter again. So unfortunately I have to do that because otherwise there may be some viewers that have not won at all. At least it gives them a chance, okay? And uh, in order to enter, you need to do the following. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already, I would definitely appreciate it. And uh, also, you know, the higher I climb in terms of subscribers, I get to do more giveaways and stuff. So that, I guess, is always an incentive. Um, make sure that you do subscribe. Make sure that you turn on the channel notification uh, icons so that you don't miss live streams like these. Uh, giveaways, I think, when was it last? No, last weekend I did the gold giveaway. The weekend before that was the Atomizer. And then before that was Ravana and I think Nightingale. So... Definitely more giveaways coming up. I'm actually, I was kind of hoping to do like the new weapons, but the new weapons are not out yet. But maybe the new Titan. Nodens, I don't know. I'm going to see if I can try to get that. Make sure to give uh, the stream a thumbs up. Also a comment related to the stream. Maybe you can tell me what you're going to run the SAR on. Maybe you have an author. You're going to run it with ruptures because you have ruptures or retaliators. Or maybe there's a funny moment that happens during the stream. Make sure you do that. And um, what I would do is uh, comment um, a couple couple of times during the stream. You don't want to spam it because if you spam it within a short period, uh, YouTube may block you and I might not even see your comment at all, which would kind of suck. Okay, so make sure that you do that. Um, I will be choosing 50 winners from the live stream chat, which is where you guys are chatting right now, and 50 from the comment section. And what you could always do to increase your chances of winning, you could post a couple of times. You know, I, I just do more like, I don't know, just post like three times between now and the end. And then afterwards what you can do is you could post it in the comment section once a stream has been published. Because I choose from both. So you can always do it that way. Uh, is the star for all titans? Uh, which star are you referring to? Am I not seeing something? I don't know. Which star are you referring to? I'm gonna mix. I'm gonna mix this up. I'm gonna run retaliators on here. Since since this whole stream is about the saw and the Arthur uh, gameplay, I have to keep both of those in. I actually don't have a. I don't have a Ming, so I can't run that anyways. Would I get the new Titan Nodens? Um, possibly. Wait, what am I doing? Whose comments do you see? I'm confused. Am I missing something? Thank you, uh, thank you, thank you, Augusto Go Gomez. I just real, I just picked up on your comment now from earlier, and also thank you, Vomit. I know you mentioned something. I saw that sticker pop up. Thank you very much for your donation as well. What is the best setup for the author? Um, the best setup for the author, this is kind of funny, is actually the regular machine guns. But I'm not sure how it's going to work when they buff the saw. Sorry, I have to reject that. 
Um, I'm not sure how it's gonna work when they buff the saw weapon because it's gonna fire quicker. So it might actually end up working pretty good. I don't know. I have to when that comes to the to the live server, I'll know. Okay, so um, let's see what can we do here. I'm gonna open up some of these crates because we have 700 coins. I generally try to save up between 300 and 500 before opening any of these up. I find the, I get better prizes overall. I hope I didn't jinx myself because I, <laughs> I haven't opened up any. But these are the prizes that I have won uh, from this event so far. Okay. So a lot of uh, components for cryo weapons, which is actually good because I don't really have many of them. Uh, a lot of power cells and gold. And I actually got my Nightingale and my Ravana from the previous event. So that's kind of where I got mine uh, from. Let's go ahead and let's open seven of these up and see what we get. More Nightingale. I don't need another Nightingale. I actually need like cryo weapons or uh, the Atomizer would be good. Actually, you know what? I really want another Atomizer so I can run it on my Nightingale, which I'm still upgrading. Why don't you guys tell me what have you? What's your best prize that you won from this event? I mean, that could be a comment. Include that your pilot ID and your platform with that. More atomizer. That's good. Come on, give me an atomizer. Full one would be good. Oh shoot! It's pausing. This must be a good prize. Please be a good prize. Uh oh. Oh, we got a rhyme. Sweet. Oh, and those weapons you will be able to uh, build after this event in Workshop. Uh, glacier. Yeah, I need more glaciers. Actually, well, actually, I kind of need all those weapons. Uh oh, it's pausing. Is this good? Well, we got another rhyme. So we got two rhymes. Yes. Although I'm running three sinister already on my Loki. Uh, what clan am I in? I am in Clan Vox. So this is on iOS. I just noticed we have a couple clan mates on. I'm probably going to run into them. Oh, I was going to show you my Nightingale. So my Nightingale, I haven't... It's not ready for like my main hangar yet. So what I'm doing is I'm actually um, leveling it up at the moment. We're at what, MK1 level 8? Going on to level 9. So I'm going to max this out. And then I, like, I'm going to probably max out the Atomizer. I have a Shredder already. I need to get another Atomizer because I, th I still think that that's the strongest build for the Nightingale right now. But if I can't run that, then I'll run Rhyme and Cryo. What is a good cheap setup for the Loki? If you want to go ultra cheap and don't laugh, no weapons. <laughs> you don't get any cheaper than that because you're going to use it just to run beacons, right? With the Loki, I generally don't try to engage head on with players. I use it strictly just to go for beacons. So if that's what you're going to use it for, you actually really don't need weapons technically. Um, I guess you could go for something like Rhyme, you could build Rhyme. I think I would actually run Rhyme on it. But you can't build that just yet in Workshop. And it's probably going to be pretty expensive to level up. But you can run it on... These guys really don't know that I'm behind them. Well, they know now. <laughs> when they find out they can't spawn there. gonna get that beacon I'm gonna try to get to yeah he used his ability so you see what I did I ran to this beacon here because he has to kill me if he wants to uh if he wants to get this beacon back, he's got to kill me first. So we're both on... Someone else going to... Uh... 
What I might try to do is I might try to delay this here. He's trying to line up his weapons. Bro, where's he shooting? What the heck? Is that just really bad aim? Or do I appeal to him on that side? I don't know, that's weird. There we go. Okay, I got a teammate. This guy's leeched. And he's not leeched now. There we go. <laughs> Man. Oh, wait. I can go for this guy. Maybe. Oh, yes. Uh... Trying to save my charges up here. Come on, come on. Four seconds before I can use my ability. Ah! <laughs> Let's do that. Get him! Move back! Where is this guy? Not shot! <laughs> oh jeez! No! Ah! Oh, someone stole my kill. Oof. Yeah, I'm not looking too good right now. Holy crap! <laughs> yes! Godlike! Oh shoot, this guy's gonna kill me. Okay, at least we can spawn on this side now. Oh jeez, I slammed him against the wall. This guy's gonna land right here. <laughs> he doesn't see me yet. Oh shoot! Ooh. Yes. Peter Pan's waiting. <laughs> what is the best setup for the Mercury? Um, I haven't actually run the Mercury in a while. Um, the reason why I took Mercury out is because of the whole phase shift thing. Because you know like how you can go for a hell dive. <laughs> And you're about to take out a play and then they press phase shift they pretty much negated your hell dive so i don't i don't typically run it but i think if i did run it i would probably run maybe glacier I'm trying to think maybe glacier rhyme which would be a good thing because you could always run that on like something like a strider but it allows you to at least hit hard in that short period of like window of opportunity that's kind of what i would probably do if you're not going to do that maybe calamity spark or something might work too oh thank you dave oh wait hold on ah oh, shoot thank you to kin Noden titan new name to me is titan gale yeah some some of you guys were calling it noodles <laughs> Maybe we should call it that. Thank you, Dave. Pin player check. Death for check. Thank you, Ego. Should you buy another weapon for Arthur? Uh, Ao Ming. Um, you know what? I would actually hold off on the Ao Ming for now because that Nodens um, Titan that we are testing is pretty much like a hard counter to the Ao Ming. So I think I would hold off on that for now. Save your uh, save your platinum. This dude's trying to steal my kill. I see what you're trying to do, dude. <laughs> he probably wasn't. I'm just saying that. Oh shoot. 
Ooh. Yeah, that, that kind of hurt. You know what I can do though? Yeah, shoot me. I go this way. What does this guy have? Ooh. Speaking of which, this guy has a very similar setup to what I just mentioned. Except he's running Exodus. Totally stole that dude's kill. You're probably working on that guy for like the past. Oh! This guy's running away. Oh shoot, this guy's right here. Whoa. <laughs> I think the Spectre jumped earlier, so he can't jump again. That other guy decided to take a swim. Maybe, oh shoot, maybe he did that on, on purpose. Uh, we got a bit of a problem here. I've been leeched like two guys. I'm so gonna die. <laughs> Come on, I gotta get this guy, maybe. Ah, oh, shoot. Um, I'm gonna park this right outside this spawn. You know, I usually use this setup sometimes to take out Titans with. Especially our Mings. If I can drop close close enough to them, then I lock them down and I sh shoot them up with this. Uh oh. I locked him. Yep. But they might drop in over here. I have a feeling with like an our Ming or something. Nope. This will do. Whoa, look at his health. Oh, shoot. Are you serious? Dude, I ran out of ammo and he's got like no health left. Kill him! Oh, yes! <laughs> this, he all got to close his front doors. Oh jeez, I think I split his shield off. No, does he still have a shield? I think he might have a shield. Oh, hello. Come on! That behemoth, that behemoth is crazy. I, I, I'm hoping it actually happens during the stream. Sometimes I can lock a player down. Oh, I think I got that guy at the end. I, I lock a player down with the uh, behemoth, like especially if they're in our Ming, and th it's crazy how much damage that thing can do. Like that's how you rack up major damage. Um, so, uh, Ego18 Noob, I hope that was actually able to uh, help you. Also, thank you guys for your donations. Um, as I said with the Platinum, because we're testing the Nodens out, um, to me the Nodens is actually stronger than the Ao Ming, based on what I'm seeing. So maybe you want to hold off on that. Um, I think that's what I would personally do. If you want to use your Platinum, I guess you could always use... Um, I'm trying to think, use it to maybe get like the... The premium modules because that, that way you can at least move it from whatever titan you have now to nodens or whichever you decide <clears throat> i actually got smoked by note by um the author when i was testing out the nodens on the test server i got smoked by the author they had uh the cataclysm and they had the cyclone weapon <laughs> they actually killed me because they had the physical shield i couldn't break through it Let's go get this beacon here quick. Oh jeez, this guy just flew to center and now he's gonna lose his bot for free. Or wait, maybe not. No! I think he's gonna fly. Yep, he's gonna fly. Wait a minute, is that a Vityaz? I, 
think I'm. I think that was a Vityaz. <laughs> I feel kind of bad shooting him. Him or her, I should say. Might be a female player. Don't discriminate. They're gonna drop in over here because they have this beacon. This guy. Ah, shoot. Come on, this guy, this guy, quick, 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 quick! Steal it! Oh! <laughs> I thought I could get that one. Come on, three, two, one. This guy. Getting him down almost to his uh, last stand. There we go, last stand triggered. I wonder if this is going to be enough to kill him. I don't know. I don't think so. Oh man, I ran out of ammo. No! <laughs> there we go. We gotta take this Ming out here. But you know what? I could actually demonstrate that that tactic with the behemoth if he gets close enough. I'll save him. I'll save him for the demonstration. <laughs> He's moving towards that side too. I might be able to get him. I'm just gonna sacrifice this Al Jung here first. This guy lost connection. Is he still flying in that? Yes, he's flying in that direction. Yeah, this is him. He's here. Hello! Locked! Shredded! <laughs> he's gonna drop soon. He's like, oh crap, that's a lot of bullets, man. Yes. He's getting hit by someone who's above there. He's trying to get me, but... <laughs> He's trying to get me! Kill him quick, dude! I got no weapons left! Ah, he still got shredded. Oh, I gotta get- I gotta steal it! Gotta steal it! Steal it! Oh, come on! Yes! What is my favorite game mode? Beacon Rush! Beacon Rush all the way! Oh, that, this uh, actually had a lot of, I think, Android players here. Like, Max Alming, that's num lethal damage from Behemoth. Yeah, no, I don't think that guy was maxed out. But usually I can get them down to like half health. But I mean, even half health, you gotta think, that's a lot of damage output. In that amount of time. But you gotta keep in mind too, I have last stand on my behemoth. Which helps. We gotta get uh, beacons here quick.
This guy, he's gonna get this uh, beacon here. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to... I might be able to get this beacon. I'm moving back here because I know he put a beacon point there. He's trying to get... He's trying to, like, hear me there and then spawn in afterwards. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, I have full hardy on this. There we go. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh shoot! Okay, we gotta get we gotta get another beacon here quick. I think we can get their home beacon. If I, my teammates mustn't kill this guy. Don't kill him! Quick! Don't kill him! Don't kill him! Am I changing this? Yes, they didn't kill him. I can get this beacon. Passing through. <laughs> this guy sees me now. Shoot, man, we're losing a beacon. We had that side. Maybe I can get this one. Okay. Yes, and this guy flew, which means he's gonna land here in front of us soon. There we go. I'm trying to see which is the weak beacon that I can attack here. If I can take this guy out, nope. I think I better go into. I uh, can't go into center. There's two guys here. Uh, two guys there. This guy just used his ability. Yeah, coming! Ah, oh, come on. Better not have QR. Oh shoot, he's gonna spawn you, right? Mmm, does he have the pilot though? I turn it white. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! Still, still, still! Yes. Yes, we got this beacon! And my teammate dropped in. Fought! 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 Yes! Pin him against the wall! Teamwork. Oh yes, he's gonna. This dude's gonna fart again. Oh wait, I shouldn't stand behind him if he farts, right? He might blow me backwards. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh shoot! Hell dive! Hell dive! Hell dive! Let's go for this beacon. Oh jeez. Oh. Can I get this beacon? Maybe, 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 maybe. Oh shoot! No! And the dude blew my my kneecaps. Okay, what do we have going on over here? There we go. Oh shoot. This guy's gonna hide in the tunnel here, but you know what? I can actually kill him from above. I need to get 200 and watch this. 100, 100, 100. No! Got him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. So 
Is that guy hitting me or the other guy? Oh, there's another one here. I didn't even see this guy. Come on, drop the shield, drop the shield. Oh. Oh, she's so close. Hundred, hundred, hundred. <laughs> He's gonna move this way. That did a death fight from this side of the wall. Come on. Oh, are you serious? Shield. No. I think these will, these two can actually kill me from their uh, stove ability if I'm not careful. They leveled up. I don't think they, le oh wait. I just realized there was an Ao Ming there by their spawn. I could have gone for him. Uh, oh, we got a thousand. Okay, so what we can do is we can go through the rules once again. And then while we're doing that, I can open up the gold chest from the black market. Oh, thank you, uh, Ego. Ego18 noob. I hold your art upgrades after level 20. Yeah, I would hold your, your upgrades. I think um, if you're worried about like your Arthur or your kid or um, the Yao Ming not really performing because of the Nodens, like if it's not as powerful as that what you can do is you can start working on the weapons that you know can possibly work on nodens um, if that is a problem and you're still not sure work on modules save up for the modules level it up because the modules you can move from titan to titan it doesn't really matter the only thing it really affects is the amount of health you have or um, if it's antimatter reacted or affect the amount of damage okay so uh what i'm gonna do is i have up on the screen what you need to do in order to uh, enter the giveaway so i'm going to be giving away a hundred saw weapons my voice is echoing oh wait is it really echoing it shouldn't be echoing um you guys hearing are you guys hearing an echo shouldn't be an echo Oh, okay, so for those of you asking, before I get actually to the giveaway uh, details and stuff here, for those of you who are asking about the goal from last weekend, I am aware that you guys have not received your goal, so I've messaged Pixonic. Um, it is the weekend right now, so maybe that is the reason why there's a slight delay. Um, so your gold will be coming, um, if you could just be patient. And uh, also apologies for the delay, okay, so I, I am aware... And I have uh, mentioned this to them. Okay, there's no echo. Okay, good. So, uh, yep, we're going to be giving away 100 SAR weapons. Which is... Uh, let me just switch back to this screen here. So, this is the weapon that I will be giving away. So, 100 of these. Uh, if you have already won on my channel in the past 4 weeks or 1 month, then unfortunately you cannot enter again. Or at least uh, I should say enter. Because I want to give the others a chance here are those that have not won any gold in the past or like weapons or robot giveaways. This at least gives them a chance to win something. So I hope you guys understand. Um, I will be uh, selecting 50 winners in total. Well, 100 winners in total. 50 from the comment section. 50 from the uh, live stream or the comment section once the stream is done. I should have said live chat. 50 from the live chat. 50 from the comment section once the stream is done and uh, those winners will be getting one um one saw weapon each i almost said a hundred each whoa that would have been crazy what are you gonna do with a hundred 
<laughs> so yeah and in order to enter you need to do the following so subscribe if you haven't already and uh, turn on the bell notification icon so that uh, or all notifications so that you get notified when I do live streams like these when I do giveaways when I um, release new content and also when I post winners uh, you know in the community part of my channel I believe you should get a notification for that as well so make sure you do that make sure that you give the stream a thumbs up and then a comment related to the stream it's very important that you include a comment um, along with your pilot ID in your platform so maybe you could tell me what is the best prize you've won from the event so far Maybe you could tell me what you plan on running the saw on, like if you have the Kid Titan, maybe running that with Retaliators or maybe the Arthur. Make sure that you do mention that. Be very careful of spamming multiple times um, because YouTube may block it and I might not see your comments, which means you'll lose. So yeah, make sure you don't do that. Uh, maybe post it three times between now and the next hour. Okay, and then you can always post afterwards in the comment section. Um, I'm just reading the comments here. Okay, so while you guys post, we are going to open up a gold chest here and see what I win. Okay, wait, I'm going to go through the prizes of what I would like to win. <laughs> Whether I get it or not is another story. So 5,000 gold would be really good. A rhyme would be really good. Um, I actually kind of want the Sinister Pulsar as well because I have three right now. I haven't really leveled them up, but I kind of like the design of them, so I wouldn't mind winning that. Um, the Glacier would be nice. Cryo would be nice. Power Cells and the 10 million silver would definitely be nice and the 1000 gold. I know a lot of players don't like the 10 million silver, but it actually, um, like for me, it's actually better to win 10 million like when you have most things and I'll show you why um, let me just see what do they have here in this I'm trying to think if I have an extra weapon like a pulsar which I can show you um, maybe I sh I'll show you the reason now why I say it's actually better that you win 10 million so let's just say for example I wanted could I even, oh man, I have to put weapons on all my bots again. I can't sell, that's the downside. So wait, I need a, I'm just gonna, you guys wondering why you sometimes see players with the Kazakhs? It's because you can't sell anything, so one of the easiest ways is just to build, um, to buy a Kazakh. Fill that spot, then you can sell the weapon or a robot. So I'm gonna do that now. Um, I think I should be okay, actually. So I'm gonna try see if I can find one of those weapons just to kind of like de do my demonstration here but let's just say I were to sell a scourge because I won a scourge you only get like two million silver so that's why I actually or actually has uh, was Hussar one of them igniter was one of them so if I were to sell one of these I only get three million silver right so it makes more sense for me to actually win the 10 million silver because that would be like equivalent to three of those so just saying, that's kind of the reason why I prefer the that one. But we're gonna roll. We're gonna open up uh, one of these and let's see what we get. Better than another Corona. Yeah. So it looks like I got it, but that is totally fine with me because, as I said, it's worth like three calamity or whatever. So it's a better prize. It's one of the better prizes, even though players think it's not. It actually is. So whenever I'm like on my baby account, when I'm playing that, if I manage to save up a thousand, I actually wish that I had that because in a, it's one upgrade for like a storm or whatever. 10 million. Okay, so we are going to, I don't know, which uh, setup do you want me to run on the Arthur? Do you want me to run the Saw with the Ruptures or do you guys want me to run Retaliators on here? Still nothing you can't change yeah a lot of a lot of top players prefer the silver but just my opinion I think when you get to this point you'll understand ways are they making more ways to get platinum um, I do believe they mentioned uh, in the last 
development stream, the dev stream, they mentioned that they will be adding more ways to get platinum. I think it's going to be coming actually in the next event, which would actually be their birthday event, so it's got to be pretty soon. So I think that's the one that they said, or in the future, but they are planning on it. Some are saying Rapture. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Tom. And uh, also thank you to uh, Troy Cook for becoming a member uh, of my channel. Um, you know what, guys? I was actually... <laughs> this actually happened like a while back. I sent out a message to the like my community thing. And it's only supposed to go to paid members. And I was going to give a link to my Discord. And that actually didn't work because YouTube removed that feature. Or at least that option. So, I think... If I'm not able to track you down, you could always track me down through Facebook. I do believe I have a link uh, in the live stream description. And then I will send you guys a link to my uh, Discord. So I'm hoping that I can catch that. Um, on Behemoth, try two Avengers to... You know what actually works really well? Is uh, two Glory and two Redeemers. I can run that too, but I use this to, to counter Titans though. Your subscription got paused and you're back now. <laughs> Thank you for uh, resubscribing or, yeah, resubscribing. Okay, let's go ahead. Wait, did I change? Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, shoot. I think I got distracted. I don't even know what I have on my author. It could be a total disaster. We're going to run it anyways. Holy crap, the game's already started. Oh, man. I already got leech and I just spawned in now. Come on, are you serious? Dude. Mm. 40 seconds into the game. Yeah, this is not ending well, man. This is definitely not ending well. Getting smoked here. Okay, I had to hold this beacon down here. I'm gonna get killed by this guy. For sure. No, oh, shoot. And they're storming into center. Better stop this guy because I don't trust my teammates, man. They almost lost this one. Steal it! Ugh. <laughs> this is a thing with the, the Ravana. It's like constant phase shift. And no! There we go. Save up my uh, shots here. I think we're going to lose a platform. Actually, you know what? If we lose a platform, I think it's going to be fine because we can always spawn there. Because that's where I spawned in. Um, see, this guy moves off this beacon. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Oh, <laughs> he put up his, uh, he put up his shield. Come on. Oh, almost took that dude out. What the heck is going on here? Trying to take this guy out here. He's running beacons on us. So I gotta make sure I stay on these beacons. Maybe get this guy down to his last stand. She's phase shift. He's, his next attack is gonna die here. I think. Yep, there we go. I gotta hold this. So where, where are my teammates? Nope. Uh, guys, hold that down. Hold that down. I need to run my beacons here quick. Shoot, man. I started this game late. Oh, I'm at a disadvantage. Started like 40 seconds late. The guys were, were in my spawn already. I need to, I need to go for these beacons. Whoa, look at my Loki fly. Look at the height. 
<laughs> okay, we're gonna get this beacon. That's good. Um, I'm not really worried about that beacon yet. Let's try to get this. Uh, let's try to get this other beacon here. Yeesh. Wait a minute, we've only got three players. What? Talk about being a uh, disadvantage. No, we got five. We got five. This guy gave me the beacon. Where is he? You may land now. Thank you. Um, this guy used his ability up, which means he can't leech. We should take this dude out now. Now wait, forget that. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try to see if I can get this beacon over here on the platform. Spawn right next to this uh, Ao Ming. If I, oh wait, there's going to be two Ao Mings here. Maybe I can get... If I can do that and lock. Come on, I got to get, I got to do this. Quick, 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 quick. Am I getting it? No, this guy's here. My team's getting wiped out. Ah. Um, I think what I should do is I should drop in over here. Trying to see if I can perhaps get this beacon. Oh jeez. Man, there's so many of them here. Ah! Okay, we got this beacon. That's good. Okay, at least we got that beacon. Um, let's just see. How are we going to do this? Locked. Come on. Why is my thing not... Shut him up! Oh, almost. I think I'm gonna end up dying. Ah! Yes! <laughs> Started late and I still won. Yes! Whoa, that was close, man. Oh, they were squatting too. Whew! Good thing we got all those beacons. And I can't see that we are a player, but I'm pretty sure the Ao Ming is close to maxed out. I think I would have been able, actually able to kill him in my behemoth, but for some reason I didn't switch to the other mode. When I clicked it, it didn't work. Man, they had so many. That is actually where I wish I had machine guns. When you're dealing with that many Mings. You were the kid that was beside me in the live stream. Good game. <laughs> what is the best setup for the Aries? I don't know if there's a best setup. I know there's some setups that kind of work pretty good. Like I did try recently. I think I was using uh, two Pulsar weapons and Spark and that worked pretty good. Yeah, man, I started that game. I was like 40 seconds in, dude. 
I didn't even... I had to, like... <laughs> had to run a lot of beacons, quick. Two guys here, yeah, I gotta be careful. Do this. Whew, that was close. I just saw my ammo and I was like, I better save some for that guy. Um. This guy. Um, forget this. I'm going to go to the center. It's going to be a firing range. Ah! <laughs> <He's>, <laughs> I locked all of them down. You know what? I'm just gonna shoot this guy anyways. If I'm gonna die, you're coming with me. <laughs> I still shared them up pretty good. Um, let's use Aljun. No! I know you don't have your ability. Dude, same team. I need to try to take out that Ao Ming there. Oh, he's flying lower. He messed up. I <laughs> just walked past the Ares. The Ares is on his team. No wait, he's on our team. We lost that beacon. Uh, you know what? Oh jeez, that was a leech. I need to, I need to, I put my shield down because I need to get my damage in quick here. The game's almost over. Pixel left. I'm trying to maximize my damage. Come on. Ah. Does beta weapon bypass resistance? Both of them actually do. Both the both the beta and the alpha, they changed that um, after they released Titans. That was pretty much the nerf to uh, the indirect nerf, I should say, to Leech. Leech has actually been nerfed three times, but not the actual stats. There's certain things they changed. That was one of them. Um, the other one that they changed was the phase shift from five seconds to three seconds, because a lot of top players tend to use phase shift along with the leech ability, so that was a nerf. And then they changed um, the shotguns. Okay, 
Let's go this way. I play for free. I had to get to this beacon here. Wait, if this guy keeps shooting me, I'm gonna kill that dude. Oh, I was hoping he would kill the Spectre. <laughs> How much health does he have? <laughs> Half health. Wait a minute, is that Loki on our team? He's trying to get me, but I'm waiting. There we go. Man, we got a 5 cap, this game's gonna be over. <laughs> I gotta I was gonna say I gotta get my damage in but <laughs> this game's over already. Wow. They changed the price of saw. I don't think they did, did they? Um no no, they didn't change the price of saw. It's the same price. Or did they say they were gonna change it? I don't know. Seems the same to me. Your time is worth this, you have to put in a lot of hours. I think you can actually come up with a pretty good hanger playing for free. I know a lot of players don't think that, but then I get some players saying that my baby account hanger is stronger than theirs. Now, oh wait, it's a hover! Yes! Three points! Three points! Thank you! Oh, he didn't even make it into center. Did he even fire actually? I don't even know if he fired. Yeah, you can you can build actually a pretty strong hangar. Um, you know, you, a lot of the stuff that you, you have like in workshop you can build. Um, I do understand that it takes a, a, a while to get it, but you don't want to rush it anyways because it takes... You have you need the silver to upgrade it. Okay, we're gonna do this. Man, these two Fenrir's are tough. I don't know what they ate for breakfast this morning, but holy crap. They obviously ate their Wheaties. Yeah, wait, we didn't get that, that other beacon. Guys, the other beacon, other beacon. Must get this beacon, quick. Why is he, ah. We didn't get that side beacon. And this leech, you are gonna get whipped by me, dude. Yep, guess what? I got a lot of phase shifting going on here now. Now I use this one. Your ability is wearing off, dude. Now I use this again. <laughs> See ya. Oh, shoot.
Ah. Get the beacons back, guys. Inside his bubble. There we go. Take this guy out too. He's good. They're gonna drop in you. Inside his bubble. Yes. Yeah, protect the beacons. Watch the right. He's gonna get that beacon. Come on, guys. Oh. Man, they gave up the right side. Mm. Let's see if I can get this beacon back here. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. We're losing all our beacons here. I'm going to see if I can try to flush them out with my Titan on this right side. My teammate's not covering their, their home beacon. Let's get this guy. Whoa, this guy's... Uh, his Falcon is a super Falcon there. We need to get this beacon. We're losing all our beacons. We're only going to have one beacon left. Come on, guys. Get these beacons quick. No beacons equals lose. <laughs> I'm trying to get close here to this guy. Ah. My shield has broken. I'm trying to run beacons here, pushing these guys back if I can. If I can maybe get this beacon, that would be good. Come on, come on, get it, 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 yes! So even if they kill me now, it's okay, we got four beacons. Problem is, they're all in our Mings, and you know what I say when the other guy's in our Ming? One of the most annoying bots is this one that I'm in right now. See, he's trying to run back to this beacon. Now, what? You're gonna land on here, but I know you can't kill me. Which means you can't attack my teammates, and you can't go for our hope beacons. <laughs> really annoying. He's gonna waste all his time trying to hold the beacon down while my teammates slaughter his team. <laughs> He's looking. <laughs> There's two of them here too. They can't do anything. One Loki locked down two our Mings. Whoa, I think I just went up against all Android players. Uh, yeah, maybe. They don't have any keys. Wait, do we have any these done? Nope. If you had to do it over, would you still pick Arthur? Hmm. That's a good question. I think I probably would go Nodens. Uh, just for the healing though. Because it heals and suppresses. But the thing is, that's based off this week's test server. Which is kind of risky too, because you should never really base things off a test server. You know what I mean? Like, I said in my video that I did that 
because it's a first round of testing, obviously it's going to look OP because they usually are very extreme in the way that they do their test servers at the start. You know, like any new weapon or like mod or anything that you try out is always going to be really overpowered. Jeez, this guy. He's going to be flying here soon, but I did get him down really low on health. Uh, come on, come on, come on, lock, 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 lock. Go. Just, just do this, because I need to I need to deal with two guys here. To kill this guy. Let's do this. Trying to run to this beacon here. If this guy hits me, well, I was gonna say if he hits me, I can redirect that damage to that Al Jung. Uh, I've been leeched now. I'm watching my health in case I need to use my uh, phase shift. Let's take that guy out. I think he's gonna drop in over here though. No, nope, maybe not. <laughs> God like we gotta watch out for this guy they also going for a home beacon back there they got a home beacon I'm gonna fight on their home beacon here so they can't steal it Gotta get rid of this guy though, man, that's a strong falcon. Is there a guy here? Oh, he's right next to me. Hello. <laughs> oh, don't give up that big... Holy shoot. Okay, wait. I need to reload. Let's take out this guy. Look how fast my leech is going. If you're wondering why it goes so fast, it's because I got Adam and Roadhog on it. <laughs> if the other team has three beacons on me, it goes super fast. Look how fast it's going, it's like faster than a phantom. <laughs> Hello. Godlike. Another godlike incoming. Godlike. This guy. Godlike. Come on. Ah. This guy will have to do. Ooh. God like. God like. Come on. God like. God like. God like. God like. God like. <laughs> God like. What's that guy camping all the way back there? The action's over here, dude. Ah shoot, I'm gonna die, man. I'm so busted up. My leech is like done for. Wait a minute, I was in this bot for like four minutes. Oh, Finally go down. <laughs> After I wiped them all out with that. That was insane. Let's get this guy. What the heck was that? Ah! <laughs> oh shoot! He has his shield up though. I always place tell place not to do that. Oh crap! I've got to engage this guy here like this. Let's do that. Let's do this. I'm trying to stay on this beacon here. Gotta take this guy out. I need this beacon, man. 
Two our mings. Um. You may want to drop, just saying. He's not going to have much of an arming left. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> oh, this game is actually pretty intense. I think I'm going to score like some crazy high score in this game. I haven't even used my Arthur yet. Okay, wait, I better reload here because when I go after that dude, I'm going to need like all the firepower to take him out. Why is this guy looking at me? Dude, other side, other side! No! Shred him up! Bullets everywhere! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Look at that! <laughs> the Leo's... <laughs> the Leo was looking, he's like, Whoa, maybe I shouldn't get involved with that. Oh crap! Oh man, and my weapon's in reload! Come on, re reload, 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 reload! <laughs> Behemoth right next to this guy. Oh shoot! <laughs> he's looking around, he's like, whoa, what hit me? Half his health is gone. Titan, Titan Slayer. This guy doesn't know I'm right here. Titan Slayer. Titan Slayer. Whoa! <laughs> That's funny. The animation. Come on, get closer! Triple kill! Yeah, I figured I did quite a bit of kills in this game. But man, I was going under some crazy uh, like streak there with the, uh, the leech. That was crazy. How many godlikes did I get? You wiped out the entire team with just that bot alone. Uh, yeah, but that was my clan mate inviting me. Sorry Viking, can't run. Okay, so we have like, uh, we have like two or three games left. <laughs> Adrian Slayer. Hi Smash. Come on, come on, come on. I think I'm gonna run into a clan mate of mine. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm actually kind of shocked I didn't. At least not yet. Chloe the cat. Come on, come on, get. Ah! Oh, gotta fix that. Here we go. Here we go. Don't worry, I'm here, I'm here. Coming through. This guy is just friggin' camping, dude. Buzz off. I'm gonna attack on the right side because they're starting to flank you on this side. Maybe what I should do is do this. Leech onto that guy so these guys will shoot me. <laughs> And then I'll deal with both of them on both flanks. 
Rampage. Uh oh. Holy crap, that was close. 16,000 health. This way, this way, this way. Oh, oh no, I'm gonna die to Natasha. No, 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 Why is this guy? Why are they all... St yes! Is that Leo or whatever still back there? Dude was camping the whole time. Oof. I think that guy lost connection. I got stuck. Come on. Ah. No. I gotta keep away from that uh, titan there, otherwise he's gonna burn me up. <laughs> I try to I try to hang off the edge. There we go. Come on, reload my weapons. Oh shoot. Fifty thousand. Ah! Oh, come on. <laughs> What I see here. Titan Slayer. Titan Slayer. <laughs> I'm gonna go up on this up on, on this uh this bridge. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, look at the look at this uh, this Titan's health. Come on, lock them all down. Oof. I don't think I'm going to be able to break through that Arthur's shield here. Not with this build. Oh, they got a Raijing! Trying to get really close here. Wait, lag? Why is this guy standing still? Ah, face shift. Whoa! 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 What the heck? <laughs> he's on the he's on the raging. 
I kill him? <laughs> the dude saw my- hey, he saw my- what? <laughs> I guess that's one way to take out the enemy. <laughs> oh shoot. He climbed on the right jing. No oh, man, I totally stole that dude's kill. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. The author was on the Raijing's head, and then we killed the Raijing, and he was on my head afterwards. I don't even know what happened there, that was really weird. <laughs> but I think the author couldn't move because he was turning around. So it must have, like, I don't know, it must have messed up his aim or something. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> Six feet from each other. I know, social distancing. Oh, we got a God's player on our team. Ozzy Boris. Trying to move this way. We've got, we're going up against some uh, iOS players here. I know that bird dog player is pretty strong. Come on. Whoa, we need some beacons fast here. What the heck? Maybe I can get this beacon while these guys are hanging on this side. Oh shit, he's got the pilot. I wonder if I can make it to this side. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. That guy's gonna go in a flight. Ah! <laughs> Come on, please, 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 can I get this? Uh-oh, yes! Oh, no, 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 If I can take this guy out, I might be able to get this beacon. Can we get it? Yes, we got it. Oh, that's huge. Wait, he better spawn in over here. It's gonna stop. Nice! Okay. Now I will push. Let's push this beacon here. Oh man, wait, he didn't. We lost that beacon? I think we're gonna lose that left side. Oh, yes! Okay, we might be able to get this beacon. Nope, couldn't get it. Jeez, this is like the counter to his Arthur. Titan Slayer.
Oh yes, I'm getting healed. Nice. Wait, 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 wait. Watch out. This guy. Teamwork. This Mender. This Mender shit. He deserves a, a shout out. Okay, we gotta get we gotta get into the center here. This guy's gonna steal this beacon. Okay. Yes. Try to get this beacon. Oh shoot! Sorry, dude. Ah! I'm trying to get to the side here. Whoa! It's kind of getting crowded. Come on! They broke my shield. I have to turn this way now. <laughs> we gotta improvise. There we go. Okay, so at least we got this beacon. Is he gonna land it? He's gonna land at center. Ah, oh, shoot. <laughs> We're trying to push this side to get another beacon here because... These guys keep running beacons on us. No! Yes! They might drop in here again. Yes. I think we got this covered now. I'm trying to see if I can get close to this uh, Ricardo guy. Maybe I can drop in with my behemoth. I was going to drop it with my Ravana to protect the other side. Yeah. Trying to get all my tasks done here. Uh, I'm just reading the comments here. Oh, thank you, uh, Hang Lee. Adrian, bug or Cerberus not able to suppress? I think actually someone mentioned that in our YouTube, um, like our chat with Pixonic, the YouTubers, someone did mention that there's a bug for it. I'd have to look further into that because I don't always run the Cerberus on the Battle Rec account. Um, but Someone did mention it, and it wouldn't surprise me, because that body is still kind of new, so you might see bugs. Um, so, okay, so I think what we'll do is, I'm going to run one more game, and then I'll go over the rules and stuff again, in case you happen to drop by and you miss, um, you know, that part of the stream. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to do that. Oh, thank you, uh, Lucas. I didn't see your, um, your donation as well. The team with more... <laughs> Androids always lose crazy. Well, we don't know that it's always Android. It could be Amazon too Kind of works it works like both ways though 
I mean, I've, I've seen that on iOS as well. Okay, let's go and get some beacons here. This is the last game. Better be good. It's gonna be epic. Let's hope. <laughs> Honor. Ah, that player's from iOS. Okay, so that's good for, for my team. We've got an iOS player here. Uh... Where's he going? Where's this dude going? <laughs> I'm not sure where he was going. Come on, come on, come on. Oh shoot, my health! Yeah! I was lucky. I might be able to get this now. I think, right? Right? Yes. Maybe go for this guy. If I can get him down to... Well, he doesn't have last end, but maybe take him out. Are you serious? There we go. Um, okay, wait. You don't want to drop in over there. We will drop in way back here. Take that guy out. I'm thinking of attacking on this left flank. They actually have a few Aljungs here, so I could probably take like this guy out. Let's do that. What the heck is that guy doing? He's like bouncing? Is it just me? Why is that guy bouncing? That's an invader. Weird bag or glitch. And he suppressed miss. Triple kill. Rampage. Uh oh. <laughs> this kid's moving in this direction, but I think I can take out this guy before I die. Yes, godlike. And this guy here too. Come on, another godlike, godlike, godlike. Ah, shoot. This guy will have to do. Godlike. Ooh. Oh. Oh, come on. I almost got that leech. Okay, we'll use the behemoth now because you know you, they're bringing out all their titans. We can use it to shred them up when they get to center. Ah, oh, shoot. I tried to lock. <laughs> this guy, I locked this guy. Whoa, look at his health. <laughs> it's like, get to cover quick. Now I'm gonna shred him up again. I need to get out of here. Dude, this bad spot. Whoa! <laughs> Wait, why is he jumping towards center anyways? Oh, he wanted to flip me into center. I see what his plan was. Lock. Lock, 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 lock them all down. Lock, 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 lock you too. <laughs> I locked all of them down. <laughs> This guy, shut him up. Whoa, look at his health. Oh. Yes. Oh, look what they got here. This guy. This guy's in a in a Ao Ming. Prime target, please go in a flight. When he goes in a flight, that's when I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna come around the corner and lock him down. Wait, what's going on over here? These guys are moving on this side. Yeah, wait, he's trying to move into center. No! No! Locked him! Yes! <laughs> he has to stay on the ground, otherwise he's gonna have no resistance. Shredded! This guy too!
<laughs> nice. This guy, yeah, he's trying to push me off in the the. Dude, you lucky that that the author? I don't have the author. He's not on the other side. This guy, lock. Yes. Oh man, this guy's getting shredded up. Whoa, look at his health. <laughs> I think they're running all their titans here now. Yep. Let's get this guy. Oh jeez. That's like meat grinder right there. I locked this guy as well. I'm kind of getting him. I'll go for this guy. <laughs> Whoa, look at his health. <laughs> yeah, I'll move back too. Center! Ah. Uh. <laughs> He's gonna move around the corner. He wants to leech onto me. I better not move here. Let's go this way. At least I locked these guys down. Took that guy out too. Whoa, I actually took out a lot of titans with it. Um... <laughs> I'm gonna get this beacon. He doesn't have quantum radar. Yep. Oh, I better get my damage in quick. The game's gonna be ending. Yes. I told you that behemoth is brutal, man. That thing shreds up everything. You just gotta get. You gotta get within range. Sorry, beats. Okay, so that's going to be the last game of the stream. I'm going to go over the rules for the giveaway once again before we end things here. Okay, so I'm going to be giving away 100 of these saw weapons. So There's going to be 100 winners in total. Um, another thing to mention, if you've won any giveaways on my channel in the past month or four weeks, you will not be able to uh, to enter, unfortunately. And the reason why I'm doing that is just to give others a chance. Because there's, you know, there's been some out there that have not won any weapons or gold or anything. So at least they'll have a chance of winning something, possibly. Um, depends on how many enter. Um, in order to enter, you need to do the following. You have to make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure that you turn on all channel notifications so that you get notified when we do streams like these, whether it be giveaways or regular streams or just you know other content that I put out. Or if I announce the winners, um, you're going to need to know that as well. So make sure you do that. Make sure that you give the stream a thumbs up and also include a comment related to the stream. And that could be anything like maybe a funny moment happened during the stream that you found funny and you will include that with your pilot ideal platform or you could tell me what was one of the best prizes you won from the event so make sure that you put that in be very careful of spamming multiple times or posting like 20 times in like five minutes don't do that because youtube will pick it up and in some cases they actually ban accounts which in that case i don't see your comment anyways but be very careful of doing that i would actually because it's at the end of the stream i would only put it once and then wait until the stream gets published and you can post in the comment section for an additional chance to win okay and the winners are going to be posted on i want to say on tuesday night uh, possibly wednesday because we do have like 100 winners and the prizes in terms of when will you get them 
I usually say by Saturday, but the last weekend, uh, those winners have not received their prizes yet, so I am well aware of that. I did send a message to Pixonic, so hopefully you guys get that uh, soon. <laughs> hey Brian, did you win? <laughs> Thank you for your donation, by the way. I haven't picked any of the winners yet. We're going to be doing... I, I tend to do that after the stream. I actually go through uh, the live chat as well, and I pick different parts of the stream, and then I do it that way. Okay, so make yeah, make sure that you do that, and I think I think that's pretty much it in terms of how to enter. I'm trying to think if I missed anything, I don't think I did. Oh, one thing I guess I could mention is if you don't know where to find your pilot ID, or if you want to make sure that you paste the correct pilot ID because you're not sure, go to the settings where you see my name and my pilot ID. If you click on the bottom right corner of that box. You can copy your, your pilot ID and paste that into the chat. It will paste the correct pilot ID 100% of the time. So make sure you do that. Um, let me just see. Oh, thank you, Tom. <laughs> no doc, you lost. <laughs> and I think someone wanted to see like my stats and stuff. This was a while back. So yeah, I am in Champion League, as you can see. I am in an S rank clan. And this is my main account. This account does not belong to Pixonic, for those of you wondering. Uh, well, I mean, I, for starters, I don't even run everything maxed out. So, 30,000 victories. I hit that um, this past week, so I'm really proud of that. And that's my hangout. Thank you. Thank you, Lawrence. Did you tell Pixar to cut the damage of those new beta Tider weapons? Uh, yes, I did. But I, I had other comments on it too. So one of the things was I said that I think Cyclone does way too much damage. Um, I didn't even really get a chance to test the Cataclysm. Usually when I go onto the test server in the mornings, I give it something new and I need to post a video on it. Those three hours that I spend is really trying to get that footage so I can edit. Um, and then afterwards when I have time, I will go onto the test server and kind of try to see if I can look at things a little bit more closely. But um, one of the things that I did mention in my chat with them and, you know, the other feature channels can kind of confirm this too. But I did say that the uh, Cyclone weapon was doing way too much damage for one. Um, the other thing that I mentioned too about the, uh, the Nodens Titan. I was saying one of the things that I would prefer in the game was if they had um, Titans that, could, that had very specific roles. For example, if you wanted to be a brawler, then the Titan kind of reflects that gameplay. So for example, the Arthur. Uh, if you want it to be more like a sniper, for example, then maybe the uh, Ao Ming kind of suits that because you make it kind of fragile, or they should make it more fragile, I think. Uh, if you're gonna be running like 600 meter weapons, uh, in the case of the Nodens, um, the thing that I mentioned with that thing, it does everything. And I, I don't like these uh, Titans or bots that can do everything. I prefer having a specialized uh, skill so for example with the nodens it heals up right maybe it doesn't have suppression maybe it can heal multiple players but maybe if it does that then it loses all kinds of resistance because titans themselves actually have some resistance so that would make it a, a, you have to play it more as a support bot but you can heal your teammates up so just something like that is kind of what i mentioned uh, whether they decide to listen is their own thing But at least they've heard my side of it um, Thank you doesn't matter no beacons Louis needs to flash on Android play screen every <laughs> It's not just Android though. I like iOS too, but I just find more on Android But it might also just be because of the uh, player pool being larger. So it's all relative Um, okay, so someone is asking me what is my favorite robot right now? I actually really like the Ravana with storms um, I don't run cryo on here because I actually don't have any cryo weapons But I think um, well, I have cryo. I have cryogenic weapons. I don't have cryo leveled up is what I mean So I have mk2 level 1, but when you're running in like high champion It's better to just run everything maxed out if you can um, I already have a Loki with MK2 level 1 weapons, which it's not maxed. 
So I try to balance out the strength on my hang if I can. But yeah, my Ravana with Storm, I love this build right now. It's my favorite one to run. This and Arthur, of course. <laughs> I like I like running Arthur, but this I'm really liking the gameplay of Ravana. Will the Saw be maxed out? No, it's just regular level one when you get it. But at least you don't have to save up platinum for it to get it. And it's gonna be buffed too. In the next update, I believe. What is the best airy setup? I don't think there is a best airy setup. I'm trying to think. Somewhat telling me to run Cryo and Rhyme. I haven't run that build yet. Um, Somewhat telling me to run Pulsar and Spark. Um, I ran that. I actually did a really good job with that particular build. I don't know if I featured it yet in a Dream Hanger. Um, it might have been in one of my recent dream hangers, but I did run that and it was very effective See the thing is a lot of times players tell me what is the best build for something and very rarely is a one particular build that kind of outshines everything So for example like the Ravana if someone mentioned Ravana, which build do I think is the best? Now this one is a little bit of an exception because I do think storms are the best um, some will disagree with me and say, well, atomize it because it's a new weapon. Actually, no, it doesn't. I will flat out own, a, a, you know, a Ravana with atomizer because of how storms work. If you can get close enough, a couple of pops and that, you know, other Ravanas did. Uh, cryo weapons, you can do a lot of damage with it, but once you fire all your rockets, it's going to take a while for your rockets to reload. So in the case of Ravana, I do think storms is the best. Um, but most other bots it really depends on the situation like for example leech you might be on canyon map leech scourge work really well but if you are on dead city maybe the leech with cryo might work better because there's more cover you have the splash damage so yeah really really depends on the situation with with aries i would stick to probably more range what is the best Nemesis setup? I haven't actually run the Nemesis in a while. And I'll tell you the reason why I don't run Nemesis anymore. Is because a lot of the bots that came out had like resistance. So for example, you have the Leech, you have the Falcon if they're running the T-Falcon. You have uh, the Phantom, you have um, the Fenrir. The more resistance uh, bots there are out there, you need more firepower. And the Nemesis just wasn't doing it for me. I think I would rather run either Ares or Hades instead. But if I were to run the Nemesis, maybe, um, maybe possibly Igniter. Only because it goes through shields for once, it has kind of splash and has a fast reload time. You might even want to also try Atomizer. I haven't tried that out, but that might also be a possible uh, build for it. You still love to write Ravana Atomizer. Yeah, I actually had some in my clan that ran. Um, who was it? Someone, I think it was Sweetbread was telling me that he had run all kinds of builds for the Ravana. He tried, I think, Storm, he tried Cryo, Atomizer, uh, Scourge, and he said, he he's like convinced Storms are the best. So I said, yeah, I've run all of them, man. <laughs> you know, when you have the Battle Rec account, you test all these things to see what actually works. And I mean, the weapons are kind of cheap too. You just got to get close. It's that burst damage that makes it so deadly. Uh, <laughs> we miss Corona, the weapon return. So those of you that do have the Corona weapon, not the not the virus. If you do have the virus, then please stay at home. <laughs> um, if you have the Corona weapon, what I would do is I would keep it. Definitely do not sell it because if Pixonic sees that players aren't using it, you know what they're going to do, they're going to buff it. And they'll keep on buffing until players use it, so yeah, if you have it, keep it. Thanks, uh, Just. <laughs> what would you go with on a stalker? Okay, now you guys are just trolling me. Is the money uh, matchmaking take your total wins uh, in into account? No, it actually doesn't. So I guess I will kind of give you a very short breakdown of how matchmaking generally works. 
Okay, so I'm trying to think of how, how to best explain this like on the spot here. <laughs> um, let me just go to uh, this here first. So this is just in general how it works. So let's just say you are in Gold League. Okay, we're going to pick Gold League. If you're in Gold League, you are going to find, and this is only when you are in solo, like as a solo player. I'm not talking about if you're in squad because that's going to be a little bit more complicated. If you're a solo player and you're in Gold League, you will be playing uh, with and against players that are in Gold League, but also in Silver and Diamond. So you see how it's on either side of that league. Um, as you move up to Master, the same thing will apply. If you're in Master League, you're going to see players in Expert, Master and Champion. Okay, and if you're in Champion, you will see players in Master. Since there's no league above Champion, it's going to be mostly Champion and some Master League players. That is the general way that it works. If you are in a squad, let's just say you're in a squad and you're in Gold League, but there is another player in your squad that is in Champion League, you will face Champion League players because it will be based on the highest ranked uh, player in your squad. So be very careful of that. If you're in, once again, if you're in Gold League and you're in a squad with a Champion League player, you will run into fully maxed out like, well, not all the games, but there will be games where you run into players in Champion League that are maxed out because it's going to be based on the highest um, and it's always this game has always been that way even in walking war robots days where we had um, silver or oh wait what I think it was bronze silver and gold leagues if you were in gold league and there was a guy that was in like bronze or like silver league you know like it's you will be matched with gold uh, or gold tier rather players so that's kind of how it works now there's another thing that they also factor in it's your win percentage. So my win percentage is 90% right now, which is actually really high. Um, it's high because I was also squatting with my clan mates. So if you if you squad, especially with other strong players, chances are your win percentage will be naturally very high. If you play solo, you will get punished for it, which I'm surprised I haven't been punished yet, but I probably will be. So if I start playing more and more, eventually I will actually run into a full squad of MK2 max up players as possible and I will start losing a lot and eventually my 90% will keep on dropping all the way down to like 70 I would I want to say 70% because I think that's roughly where it I tend to kind of uh, stabilize it's based on the 50% um, elo system so how do I describe this so let's just say you have 50 you have 52% you're going to see players in your league and maybe possibly a bit higher. Um, as you drop down to between 40 and 50%, that's when you start to go through a winning streak. Anything above 50%, it starts getting harder and harder. So let's just say you are at 60% and you're in Champion League or you're in Master League. Chances are you're going to face those really strong maxed out uh, Champion League players. That's just how it works. They try to bring you back down to the 50%. So always, always look like when you face these strong players, and this applies to iOS and Android, and I guess Amazon now, not to Facebook and not to Steam. You guys will just have terrible matchmaking because the player pool is really small on those platforms. You stuck moving in between Master and Champion, you have no MK2 bots. Yeah, that's the same like my baby account. Although my baby account actually is lower than yours, it is in Champion League now. I generally only drop during when like the season restarts. How much will the Node and Titan cost in Platinum? I don't know. Um, if I had to guess, I would say anywhere from 70 or 750 Platinum to 1000 if I had to guess. Our Ming is 750 I believe. Uh, what do I think of the Cerberus? Is it worth leveling up? Okay, so the Cerberus is a fun bot to play, but it's not one that I would use in high champion league. So When I say high champion, I'm referring to players like for example that I would face, you know being Because I'm, I'm running pretty much everything maxed out if I were to use a Cerberus I wouldn't do very well against other players that are 
running leeches, aljungs. So my answer to that is probably not. I would rather focus on Ravana or Nightingale. Is Pixonic developing a squad or clan only option for gameplay? I think you can do custom battle. Is that what you're referring to maybe? For Aljung, what is the best setup? So if you're running if you're running the Yang Li pilot, which is the one that I have, I think the Dragon Calamity is probably the strongest because it's a hard counter to other Aljungs. Um, after the Aljung nerf, um, you probably want to focus on weapons that can do a lot of damage in a very short period of time because they are slowing it down, right? So you can't you can't fly like across the battlefield to smoke someone anymore. If they're going to slow down the flight, that means you are limited in terms of distance. It will still be very deadly, but you just can't play that way anymore. So you got to make sure you focus on weapons such as. Uh, Ember, Redeemer, Kalatia, I think those three in particular would be my uh, my top choices because you need to get your damage in quickly and then fly back to cover if that makes sense. So yeah, you probably want to focus on that if you don't have the Yang Li pilot. Otherwise, uh, yeah, Calamity is kind of my top choice. If you're not sure, then I would maybe just go with hmm, either Ember or Redeemer. <laughs> Troy Cook. Whoa, I'm on YouTube. What is the best weapons for the kid? Um, I would use Vengeance and Retaliators or the machine guns. Stick to it. Uh, you always get wiped out by stronger enemies when yeah one of the one of my strategies when I play like and this just applies in general because I do the same thing even on my baby account if I drop in and I know that the player on the other team is running some really strong equipment and by really strong equipment I mean like they got mk2 stuff and I'm running only level 6 robots and level 8 and 9 weapons what I try to do is I try to go for the beacons quickly now, the reason why I do that is so I can drop in and get my damage in quickly for one. The other reason why is to drive the other team's beacon bot on quicker so that that player that has all the level up stuff doesn't get a chance to use all his level up stuff on me. So it is so important, man. If you don't go for beacons and you are getting punished and you think the game is always against you and you are losing, that is the reason why you are losing. It's because you're not getting the beacons and you're not holding it down. You have to get those beacons. If you're playing Domination or Beacon Rush, you will be punished. And I, I've learned the hard way. That's why I'm telling you guys now, so that I save you the trouble of having to go through all of that. Is the Nightingale any good and why? It is very good right now, Mark. It is climbing. So usually when I release like my top 10 robots, that Nightingale, put it this way, that Nightingale for me right now is in the top 5, so yeah, it's definitely worth it. You can, I mean, it's on top of being really hard to kill, it can heal itself and teammates and it can suppress for one, which is really annoying. If you're in an Ao Ming and that thing's constantly suppressing you, you're going to be firing blanks all the time, so yeah, it's definitely a very strong bot. And I'm seeing more and more players in High Champion use it. I'm seeing more of them use Nightingale and Ravana. Those two, especially. <clears throat> Bye, Sylvia. Would you put the Cyclone Jadam on the Arthur? Hmm. Yeah, I, that could work. I think that could work. I would prefer to have all the weapons the same, but yeah, that could work. What about the Lancelot? Not great. Lancelot's not a bot that I would run in, in high champion either. But you know what you can do actually? Uh, if you're not in champion league, you could still get the Lancelot. Just don't level it up very high and then get really good weapons for it. Like, um, I don't know, Calamity and 
Scourge, you can build that in Workshop. And then what you can do is, when you have those weapons, you level it up. And then you build, while you're leveling it up, you build the Fenrir. And then you switch from the Landslot to the Fenrir. That's why I say don't, that's why you see me not waste my resources on leveling up my bots. It's always weapons, weapons, weapons. So I can switch them. Beacons, beacons, beacons. Yep, you will get punished. If you lose a lot of games, it's probably because you're not getting beacons. Or maybe it's your teammates that are not getting beacons. <laughs> but it, it makes a huge difference, man. A huge difference. You're, you will find you will win more games. Probably kill more Ao Mings too. Ao Jung and Nightingale are your first targets you focus on. Yep, because they are a big threat, right? <clears throat> what are the best builds for the tier and blitz? There's a lot of builds for the tier and the blitz that you could use. For the tier, Spark Scourge. Um, I tried Atomizer and Shredder. Um, but I think Atomizer and uh, what is it, the other one? Quarker? I think Quarker is the other one. When that comes out, those two would be, I think, pretty strong. Um, Rhyme and Cryo works really well too. The Blitz, I know the Blitz with Rhyme is, that thing is actually quite scary because I was running that on my Battle Rake account and I was like, man, this thing actually does like a lot of, <laughs> there's a lot of damage. When you get hit, it's like, holy crap, what just hit me? That is, it's what, those are one of those bots. And you know the Blitz is going to get like a pilot too, but I'm not sure to like what kind of buff. Thanks, Joe. <clears throat> okay, so I think I think that's gonna be it for the stream. Um, I just wanted to kind of make it like a bit more special with this giveaway, uh, you know, just because we had reached 150,000 subscribers. And um, once again, thank you very much to uh, all of you, whether you're watching the stream now or afterwards, for uh, subscribing and you know helping me out, supporting the channel. I definitely do appreciate it especially during you know these tough times which I hope you guys are all staying safe as well because things are really really bad out there and also my prayers to all the, the families out there who have lost like loved ones and if you are sick then prayers with you too and I hope you on a, a speedy recovery as well um, let me just go through my moderators that have been helping me out during the stream. So uh, Dark Warrior, O'Brien, um, Deathrow, Togi, I don't know if you were around, Samurai, Kain, uh, Sullivan, Dominic, Lone was around and Vomit as well. Thank you guys for helping to uh, moderate today's live stream. Very much appreciated. And if, um, if they have YouTube channels, I know Dark Warrior has and especially Deathrow, he actually streams quite often and he is from my clan. So make sure to check uh, him out. And uh, Lone Spank, I'm not sure. I know they have a YouTube channel. I'm not sure if they post. Um, but make sure to check them out as well. And uh, let's not forget those that uh, did donate. And also, uh, before I do that, uh, Troy Cook. Is it Troy Cook? And uh, there was someone else here too. Oh, Tom. Thank you for, um, for becoming members on my channel. Um, very much appreciated. And I think um, Dark Warrior was trying to get... Um, Troy's contact info for Discord. So I think he's going to be sending you an invite uh, to my Discord channel as well. And this is just for the paid members. Uh, but also thank you to uh, Roger, Does It Matter, The Wizard. Let me just go through this list. Uh, Paige, Boss Lady, uh, Augusto, Vomit, The Kind, or The Kind, uh, Dave, Ego, and Lucas. Let me just see if I can go through this. Uh, Hang Lee, I think Hang, I think that's how you pronounce your name. Hang Lee, Lawrence, and and Jest, and Tepo. Thank you, thank you guys for your donations. And also, if they have YouTube channels, make sure to check them out. And uh, once again, to everyone, thank you very much for helping to support my channel. Very much appreciated. So the winners will be posted uh, on most likely Tuesday night, um, Wednesday at the latest. 
um, just make sure that you stay tuned uh, to the videos especially on um, Wednesday because I'll most likely put a link to where you can find the winners and I think that about wraps everything up so um, yeah if this is the first time you happen to drop by my YouTube channel I hope you enjoyed today's live stream featuring uh, my own account with the author and the saw or two saw setups that I kind of ran I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay of that uh, make sure that you guys do stay safe, practice social distancing, washing your hands. And also prayers to everyone out there. Make sure that you stay safe. If you have loved ones and they have the uh, virus, make sure, um, you know, hope they recover safely. And I guess until the next live stream, I will catch you guys later. Thanks guys.